Hello there, internet dwellers. Welcome back to another video. Today, we have a very special video in terms of how long it is for this creator. This is a new video by Kane Pixels, and it's called The Rolling Giant, The Oldest View Part 3. We watched the other part, I believe, a while ago, and it's basically about this guy who found this kind of hole in the ground while hiking, and he decided to come back to that spot with a camera to go explore it, and he discovers this huge ass like staircase that goes all the way underground Ground. and at the end of the video he basically discovers this underground mall and then the video cuts off there so this is a 46 minute part three of that video the first part was basically going into detail about this mask or something like that i can't really remember that well i'm not sure why it's called the oldest view maybe we'll find out kane is actually working on a back rooms movie with a24 production studios so that should be interesting that's probably why there isn't a lot of back rooms content being made because maybe he's saving that for the actual movie it's Itself. But yeah, we're going to see what this is all about. Be sure to go check out Kane. They're a fantastic creator, extremely talented, like a prodigy at what they do, basically. And if you enjoy my reaction, why not leave a like, rate, and subscribe, all that good stuff. We're just going to jump straight into this. Here we go. Let me get this out of the way here. Let's, let's relax. Let's get into this. It's going to be a nice, chilled video, guys. What's good, guys? Wyatt here, back again. So mm -hmm. it's been a couple days since my last video. Um, yeah. I'm in a rush right now just because I, I have to get to class in a few minutes. So I'll try to record this quickly. But anyway, I wanted to do a update video on what happened the other day um, mm -hmm. at the end of my last video. So I haven't gone back down there since oh. the, uh, since then. But I have I have gone to the, 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 the site of the hole a couple times in the past few mm. days. Um, I took someone in the That's conference crazy. Place and I was able to get uh, a couple of um, trail cameras from my old botany professor. I ended up switching to uh, business back in like January, but I went oh, back trail to her cameras. and she was nice enough to lend out two of her trail cameras to me. So I was able to take them out there, uh, plant them, uh, one out in the bushes looking at the hole and one in the hole. Um, Interesting. Discreetly, of course. Um, and I already know, like, you guys are going to say that's totally sketch. It's it's private property. Um, <laughs> yeah, a little bit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. You know what I like about this? I love how authentic it sounds. Like, this is a vlogger who's just genuinely came across this thing. That's what I love about, like, Kane's videos is the authenticity of each video. Like, it feels like it doesn't feel, like, staged, scripted in any way. Because, like, everything's improvised an off the fly kind of thing and anything could happen at any moment and that's why i love kane's videos try, try to do that yeah, but there's no way and for like like i said for such a young age to know like that detail of storytelling you know the the visual effects the sound design he just seems to have everything all in one kind of i don't know at such a young age it's absolutely incredible i need answers so i set up the the trail cameras and i didn't see anything no one showed up mm. um i got like one deer uh, a lot of glitches, like a lot of pictures of nothing moving grass, mm. but yeah, I didn't see anyone the whole time. So that definitely doesn't really answer any questions, like why there is a mile long staircase going down to- That looks like something from Silent Hill, doesn't it? Uh, it looks like a shopping mall in the middle of nowhere, but it, it makes me less hesitant to go back. Because last time I was, I started, especially on the way out after I stopped recording, I got very paranoid I was going to run into people. Like I yeah. Some sort of sound yeah, alarm, I can imagine. But, uh, it seems really devoid of life. I, I, yeah. There's no one around. All right, so I got a dip for now, but my plan is to head back out to the woods later today um, and record Explore. a part two. So okay. see you there. Yeah, I, lo I love the authenticity of these videos. They're so good. So, so good. All right, so we're out here. Uh, I've been walking for like 30 minutes now. Uh, got off the trail a little while ago in from here, this, is this Kane actually talking? It's like I think. a straight shot through these woods. So it's nice, a couple miles. Yeah, see, I, lo I love how it's like a vlogging experience as well. It's not just, I don't know how to explain it. It's like an exploring video that you'd find on YouTube. Like it feels Finally, very like, here we are. Oh, yeah. How did he even come across this? Why was he? Untouched. I guess people like hiking, but yeah, it looks exactly the same as when I was here yesterday. To how has no one else come across this? The trail cams. 
Uh, I even set up some sticks down there. Like no other people have been walking around this area. Walked, so it, it looks like no one's been here since yesterday, at least. Mm. And no one has been there for a few days before. You can see over here, this is, uh, that's where I put the outdoor trail cam. Mm-hmm. You're not going to see much from there. Well, actually, I guess you could. Yeah. Here we go, back in. So is this, all this bit here is CGI, isn't it? You can see that's the spot where I put the- Which is crazy, because look, that's, that is mad. Oh, and also, um, uh, My this god. This right here, this went out sometime while I was away. Uh, I noticed when I was watching back the last video. I'm not sure what to make of that. You know, I'm still on the fence about sharing any info uh, with the location here. Um, yeah. Just because I, I don't know who I'm going to attract with this, and I, I don't know... Yeah, who some kind of to. cultists. Um, this is clearly no fucking joke, the, the scale of this thing. See, but here's the thing. I don't, I don't know how... Uh, if I wouldn't go down... Not on my own, I wouldn't. I'd probably get a friend and be like, hey, listen, I've found something really cool. Like, I'd genuinely vlog it. I'd be like, look, can you come with me? I want to I wanna go, like, vlog this. Think of the views, man. Think of the monies. Come on. I did a deep dive online. After well, but also there's just that part of me that's just m curious. That that kind of sure. curiosity that eats away. Time and I didn't really come up with anything. Um, there's like a uh, mining company that owns part of the land here, but I think uh, all of this is just owned by a uh, family. Interesting. Not anyone like, particularly would be notable, just like locals, I think. Man, it's so cool. But, but here's what I'll do. I'll get some kind of sleigh. Just, just you know, bomb it down there, basically. But I know that there's a wall right at the end there, so that's probably not going to end well. I'll probably end up with smashed knees and a no, flattened face. Away. I'm getting... <laughs> like, you know, on the way back, having to climb up those stairs again, and then all the way up through the woods, it was, like, dark for, like, a solid hour walking back. I thought I was going to fucking die, but... Hmm... Um, yeah, honestly, they the lights are on though, so it's not gonna help. But it's good. It's awesome how real it looks. It's crazy. I'm just gonna be quiet for a second. Just like freaking. Uh, oh, go straight back down again. Okay, yeah, we're good. We're good, folks. Ugh. Like it, I, I don't understand what the what's the program that's used to, to do stuff like this. Day after. Is it like an engine? The day before I put the cameras in, like a gaming the engine. Cameras, I, I hung around for a little while, um, sort of scouted the area uh, just to see if I could find any other uh, equipment, mm. just traces of people, really at all. Um, I didn't see anything. There was no tire tracks. I didn't see any footprints. Um, it's like, whatever this is, it's very much a uh, back door, back door. Yeah. I love the subtle there's details, like the shadow on the wall here, man. But... Oof, the music as well. Creepy. Imagine being that talented that you could just do all of this. Sound, I, I'm guessing the soundtracks this is still very uh, original as well hmm did he bring a torch with him this time rust. this is literally silent hill I don't hear any music this time. There's no music. Yeah, all the lights are still on. See, this is, it is brilliant. Cause like I said, it gets that kind of part of the mind just Everything flaring up. So like, why is this here? What is happening? Who is here? Fuck. Go on, son. Go on, son. Get in there. So what, what kind of place is this? It, like, it, it looked like a mall. Okay. And it's like completely 
silent. You know what's great about this? I'm sorry to keep pausing this, guys. I just need to give my opinion on something. But you know how loads of people love exploring videos? I think Kane has found a little niche where he can create his own environment and kind of set it, set it up in a way where it's like an exploring video. You know what I mean? And I think people would love that. I shouldn't even shine a light, ideally. Oof. So okay. dark. Reminds me of Dead Rising. Okay. I don't know why it reminds me of Dead Rising, because it's a mall, I guess. Look at this. Three, two, one. Ooh! Oh fuck! <laughs> That's such a realistic response. Like, got now. I'm good, man. I'm good. And then just probably wait in there for about two minutes in silence until you decide to go again. Go on. There's no point coming all the way down just to yeah. It reminds me of when I came across this abandoned bungalow once. I was so scared because like you could see inside and stuff, and it clearly was abandoned, which was weird. Um, but yeah, I was so scared to go in. But I, I was so curious to go in at the same time. Midtown air at walk. Midtown at walk. You need to remember your way back, Did man. You, you don't even know what to say. That'd be my biggest fear. Like, surely there's like another exit here. That can't just be the only exit. Maybe there's other stairs leading out. But imagine that this was a mall right underground, and you have to like, you've just bought yourself a 60-inch TV, and you got to lug it all, like two miles up to a staircase. That's crazy. There's got to be an elevator or something. Can you name eight veggies that start with the letter B? Um, shit, I don't think I can. I don't even think of one. This is literally like the, uh, uh, the backrooms uh, from TikTok. Yeah. <laughs> you don't say. Yeah, we fell into the backrooms. That's what this is. Nice little uh, reference there. Some Beautiful chairs. stuff. But it literally, it's just liminal spaces. That's all the back rooms is, right? Well, I mean, the original back rooms, I guess it is a liminal space. This is huge. Man, imagine, you know what I'd do? I'd bring a skateboard with me. Like, if, yeah, if this place is truly abandoned and I had skater friends, I'd be like, I found the perfect spot. It's an AMC. It's a fucking AMC. AMC, Breaking Bad. Jesse, we fell into the back room, Jesse. I got some kind of bunker. Mmm, no, that, for sure, man. Imagine how much life could live down here. It's got a long ass table. I love how he's kind of reading into the signs as well. It's very realistic in terms of like what, you know, Valley View. Thank you for shopping. Thank you for shopping. Redevelopment. Valley View Center. It's the same uh, fee as, what is this? Is that the name? What's great about this, like, say it all fell through for Kane and you know, which I don't think it will. He's got his own movie. Like, he's producing and directing his own movie. Well, not producing. We you know what I mean. It's that... If that all fell through, he could probably do some kind of job as an... Ar uh, like... Archaeologist? Not an archaeologist. Architecture. Because, like, to build this requires a lot of, like... Creativity, you know? How big is the place? It's, like, literally in the middle of fields. In the middle of nowhere.
I wonder why it's called the oldest view. AMC level. Oh, okay, so they do have elevators. All look like shops. Mm hmm. So this is like a proper mall. Yeah. Interesting. You gotta have balls to go down to a place like this on your own. I would be shitting, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, there's a light flashing over there. Or is it not? Until I hear something. I thought that was flashing. See what I see. Or maybe it was just the light reflection. Ah, see, just, there's a lot of like for art, art stuff. Like artist stuff. I'm also seeing a weird amount of stuff uh, mentioning Texas. Texas? I keep seeing Dallas show up, but I'm not sure if it's talking about the city or if it's a different thing. Yeah. But I've seen like two Texas shops. Interesting. And it's on a lot of signs. Why the hell is this here? And it doesn't even look that run down. It looks fresh. Look back. What is that? We are back. A reunion TX artist, Texas artist, and volunteers who care about Let's West Dallas. Burn their story. Care about West Dallas. Yeah, this is Dallas again. Hmm. Interesting. What's the connection here? Oh, hang on. Was that? For some reason, it's not that cold down here. Yeah. Cool back in the food court, but Studio Brion. Studio Brion. Oh. Like these are all art studios. Yeah. What the hell? Is that an octopus? What is that? Yeah, it's an octopus. Oh my god, that's terrifying. Painting. Oh, it's a painting. I thought it was like a sculpture. Oh. Oi! Hello. <laughs> Woohoo! Okay. That, yeah, that's it. I'm gone. At that point, I'm gone. So that's a real statue. Ew. It's the rolling giant. Ooh! Did the light just turn on? Interesting. Oh god, that giant's behind you, man. Oh, that's so cool. That lighting is just... Mwah! Feels a bit more lively now, but that's kind of terrifying. Like, who turned the music on? Who turned the lights on? You think you just saw someone? Where? You know what? The thing about stuff like this is, is that the the mystery is more enticing than the actual answer itself. Like things that don't really have an answer to them, or you can't find an answer, are a lot more enticing because it's like mysterious. You know, it gets that part of the brain flaring. Like, what's going on? What's happening with that giant behind you? Is that giant behind you? Or is it in, in place? Oh, is that the exit? Oh, yeah, so it is. I 
Okay, hang on. It's, it's only halfway through. We're done. We're out. Oh! Oh no! He has been walled in. Come on! Come on! We oh, that is horrifying. You have to find another way out. Oh my god. You should have brought some supplies with you, buddy. Well, I really fucked up, guys. Yeah, wow. <laughs> Are you still speaking as if we're gonna hear? Well, we are, kind of, but... So he's recording on his phone now. Go on, you might as well just have a look. Avagandas, you know? Go up, I wanna see what's upstairs. Surely there's someone here, right? You gotta think about it this way, like, what kind of unhinged, well, I was about to say what kind of unhinged serial killer would play more music and then kind of hunt you down, but that's, that sounds like something a serial killer would do. So yeah, this guy is pretty screwed, if that's the case. Exit. It says exit, okay. Reminds me of um, Las Vegas in a way. Parade of Giants. Yeah, there's a theme with the giants. What the hell is there like a leaf doing there? Who is that man? Professor Julian. Oh. Is that an actual exit, or...? Oh, it's a dead end. Exit to Preston Road. So, like, this was meant to be above ground. It's all bricked in. Oh my god, this is the worst. Surrounded by earth. It's like it just spawns there. It reminds me of, um, the freaking, what's it? The security breach, the uh, pizza plex. But then there's the restaurant underneath the pizza plex. So he's basically walled in. He's, he's, uh, avalanched in, snowed in for earth instead. He's earthed in. He's like a worm now. That was the opt- Oh, those lights have came on now. But that giant's gone! That giant's gone! <laughs> You'd hear that moving around, surely. That's a big thing. Midtown and Artist Studios. So this is just a mall dedicated to artists. Oh yeah, I don't like how the music... Is there a massive thunderstorm overhead? Oi, what is that doing? Go on, zoom in. Yeah, that's the moving statue right there. That was a different area. Dream. He's got his own shop now. That's crazy. Wait, where's it gone? Where is it? Is it behind him? Oh my god. Oi, don't do- don't do that! You're going mad. You are here. 
Holy shit. There's a lot of stores. Well, there's like a hole in the wall over there. What's going on with the camera there? Is it glitchy? I like that. Some kind of interference happening. I think there's an exit this way. The thing is, it looks so full of life and like there should be stuff here, but it's so empty at the same time. It's like freaking Kim Kardashian's house. Like, I don't know. You'd think you'd be able to survive down there. Because you'd think there'd be a load of food and stuff, but... I don't think so. Ooh, skylights. Okay, that's... Why is this? Oh my god. I don't know what I'd be doing in this situation right now. But that's a graffiti tag right there. Go on, go open that up. Midtown Artist Studios. Is that? What is that? Is this the. What? What is that? God, I don't like that. You're in an abandoned mall and you're hearing stuff in the distance. I don't know whether not to go to them or run away from them. You see if I can figure out where they're coming from. Yeah, you gotta kind of get get eyes on first. Maybe like a Yeah, I was still gonna say, guys. <laughs> you son of a bitch! Jesus! Was it like a weeping angel? Wait, is it following him? Oh, that's creepy as hell. Hello? Yeah, you can just have a look. It's obviously on wheels. Someone's pushing it around. Not multiple of them, is there? See that? I think that's got the mask that we saw in the first video. Why would you turn away from it? It's literally rolling towards you. I'm leaving. Le where? You've got nowhere to go. I don't think it wants you to leave. That's it. Keep your eye on it. Run. How fast is this thing? Oh, you silly goose. It's literally a weeping angel. Oh, it won't stop. Oh, I don't like it. Yeah, go up the stairs, man. What's it going to do? Yeah. It's its biggest weakness. The stairs. Ew. It's like, oh, you win this round. I'll be back. Oh, I don't like that. That's not nice. 
you see him like trip over the balcony. Oh, fall down completely. What's up there? Go on, have a look. He's gonna go. Why? Why would you even? Oh god, it's coming for you. Smash. Smash. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh damn, okay. Underdeveloped stuff. This could be its own horror game. Like, find yourself. You f that guy just fell over. You see him now, he's just on the floor like that, wobbling. Oh! <laughs> Where does this lead? No, why would you go back? There's no way it can fit through this hallway, right? What does that say? It says exit there. Man, how do you know that, like, that's the only one, you know? God, we got, we got 13 minutes left, guys. Anything can happen. Anything can happen. Oh, I don't want to get too out of freaking camera. Getting too comfy. There we go, there's a cafe there. Have a drink you want, you. No, is it going to slide all the way up again? Don't close it. Keep it open just in case. Oh my god. Okay, fair enough. So this giant thing lives down here and kind of like patrols the mall. But why is the mall down here? What is that thing and why is it sentient? I don't like the darkness. Turn the light on. Just like a little art gallery. Love the process. Not the... What did that say? Not the what? management office I want to know what's behind this like why it is the way it is but then again I don't know if I'd like the answers Doing it like trees, hang on a sec. Hang on. Okay, so street, so that you gotta remember that the entrance to this place was um, kind of that had a tree there, I guess. So, street trees diagram. What's that in the middle? Is it the artist of the the giant thing? Because it had like tree branches for hands. That's yeah. So that's the blueprint of the place he's in now. That's yeah. That's right. Yeah, I'd be screwed. I'm I'm terrible at reading maps. 
Look, that's a fresh ass freaking coffee print right there. What is this? Who created this? Can I help you, young man? What are you doing here? It's got, that, it's got like an old video game feel to it when you kind of... You just figured out a certain plot point, you know what I mean? And now you're walking somewhere and this music's playing. Or something's just happened, like a cutscene's just happened, and you're still, like in Silent Hill 2, when you, you stay in the room or whatever where the woman is with the mirror, and the music's still playing. Like that. There we go. That might be interesting. What does this say? In the event that primary exit routes become inaccessible, please refer to document 18371905. Okay. It could be underneath that pile. Oh, come on. I wanna, I'm, I'm curious to see... Um, exit. At AMC level. Okay. Okay, so he has to go. Oh, there's something about that AMC that, I don't know, looked weird. Okay. Is he going to get out? Is he actually going to get out? He has to get past that thing. <clears throat> he should have came down with more uh, tracking cameras and just put them around the mall. Security system. Go on and get. Talk to whoever. Yeah. What does it say on the left? Do you accept this impermanence? What? What's happening? Oh my god. The whole mall has changed. This is mad. <laughs> oh my god. The earth has taken it back like Chernobyl. I need to leave. Yeah, no shit. Come on, man. Look, so there's. Look. What is happening? This statue is very, um... So that it says Parade of Giants. So there's multiple. I wonder, like, if time's skipped since he came down here. Man, I can understand why it took so long now for this to come out. This must have took absolutely like, it's just the small little things. Like he'd have had to build the whole thing of this. Little details. Go on, run for it. Oh, the music creeping in. Go on, just run. Boy! Fuck. 
Go around the other side. Hey. Oh, hang on a sec. What was going on there? Were there multiple giants there? Oh, I think there was. Yeah, look, their stairs are their, their biggest weakness. What are they going to do? Notice elevator out of use. So where do they go then? Emergency. Oh, God. This is... Emergency rooftop exit. How the hell is that coming up the stairs? Oh, interesting. What do you want? Uh oh. If it was clever, oh what the fuck was that? They're dead pe- they're dead people! And a horse! What is happening? There's like- Oh, oh good god! Shit. Bro, you're gonna have to Shit. jump. Wait, what's that? It's like the Truman Show. Yeah, there's a dead horse there for some reason. Yeah. Well, I mean, worst comes to the worst. Just jump off head first and hope, you know, it just knocks you out straight away and you die. Where's this monster gone? What was the betting that when he gets over there, something's going to go, boo, and he goes, oh. Oh! Then he falls down and he like hits the, the bottom of that mall. Oh god, come on bro, hurry. Come on now. Come on up, you get. Oh no. Oh no. He's gonna like- oh god. Oh shit! <laughs> he was right there. He was right there! That was- that was an exit. Oh, it was Kane. Hang on a sec. What? Uh. That's creepy as fuck. Very confused as to what the hell was happening there. What happened at the end there? Was any of it real? Apparently this th this is based on Valley View Mall. The thing about Kane, right, is that he he's just an all-rounder. He is a goat, basically. He's not just good in one area, he's good in multiple areas. And when he blends them all together, it's amazing. It can be analyzed in different ways. Like what the, you know, what that guardian is. What, why the hell the mall's here in the first place. And you see that there were dead people there as well. Who were obviously trying to escape from there. What was real? That's the, that's my question. What was actually real in that? Was any of it real? Or was it all just like a hallucination? Because it seemed like this thing or whatever, this mall was just stuck in its own kind of reality this its own kind of dimension where things just kept changing time was changing you know everything around it was changing i really enjoyed that that was a very very unique video one of the best that we've watched in a while on this channel but yeah 
There we go, guys. That was the Rolling Giant, the oldest view part three. I'm guessing that's the end of that. But that was really, really good. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Go subscribe to Kane Pixels. If you enjoyed my reaction, well, leave a like, rate, and subscribe for more content like this. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you did enjoy. And I'll see you in the next video. Take care, guys.